Hello, welcome back. Um, in this video, uh, we're going to go through an exercise where we will try to find a simpler function instead of the given rational function x plus 4 ln x plus 6 divided by x squared minus 16. And the ultimate goal is to find the limit. Let me just remind you the steps and the strategy for finding the limits. The first step is all about uh, using direct substitution. So let's try to use the direct substitution. Um, so I'm going to plug in uh, negative 4 for x. So you're going to have negative 4 plus 4 ln negative 4 plus 6 and negative 4 quantity squared minus 16. Well, this adds up to 0 ln 2 divided by 0. So we end up having 0 over 0, and, and we call 0 over 0 an indeterminate form. Once we have 0 over 0 as the function value after the direct substitution, uh, you may conclude that the function here is not defined. Let me call it f. Is not defined at the limit point well, direct substitution didn't work out, so we jump into the second item, which essentially says that, can you come up with another function uh, for which that function is exactly the same as f, but not at x equals minus. So the function is a rational function, and you have a logarithmic part at the top, uh, together with the linear part x plus 4, and in the bottom you have a quadratic. So at this moment, we can, uh, we can uh, investigate if we can use the dividing out technique. So to do that, we have to rewrite this expression, especially the bottom, because the bottom of this function can be factored into x minus 4, x plus 4. This is us using uh, algebra, factoring out uh, this polynomial x squared minus 16. And this is good news because at the top and the bottom, you have exactly the same uh, term, x plus 4. Um, so we can just say, like, this function is equal to, after dividing out these factors, ln x plus 6 over x minus 4. Okay, I'm going to call this function g of x. So f is equal to g, except everywhere except x equals why f and g are not equal at x equals negative 4 because I know that f is not defined at uh, negative 4 however g is defined in fact this limit now turns out to be the limit of the g function which is ln of x plus 6 divided by x minus 4 and by using uh, the direct substitution here, um, ln, we get ln2 over, um, let's see, minus 8. All right, that's the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Um, I'll see you in another video. Bye.